this is a beautiful uh, upright piano. I mean, we've, I mean, it's just like I always say, do we need another uh, felted upright or do we need another piano library? And, you know, I always say the more the merrier because each one brings to it uh, a different personality, a different color, a different tone, a different emotion. You know, the thing is when somebody is sampling a piano, they're putting a part of themselves or any instrument, they're, they're putting a part of themselves into, into it. So it imparts a personality, it imparts their feelings and their emotions. And, you know, that's why I love having so many uh, different types of pianos. Now, what makes this one a little different is that it is the, it's the only one that I know that is quadruple felted. So they put four layers uh, of felt on the, uh, on the piano. And that just gives it an even more, uh, to me, a more intimate, soft sound. And so um, I'm going to um, just pull this up. Now this, this uses Contact 7. So Contact 7 introduces uh, some new effects and Verticale uh, actually takes advantage of some of those. And we're going to, um, we're going to experience that. So. I'm going to just drop down the snapshot and we're just going to uh, take a look at um, the balanced quadruple felt. Quadruple felt, now that, what a, what a concept that is. So here we go. And you know how, you know what like, uh, as it is, you know, where the hand lands and <laughs> you never know what's gonna happen, but it's landed on D flat right now. It's almost bell-like up here. Yeah, this, this sings. I want to turn the dynamic range uh, all the way down so I can just kind of get the full um, full range. I, and I've got my velocity bumped up a little bit, but uh, yeah, listen to how that sings. And the thing is, you got to see something in that interface. This is a dead giveaway for, um, this is it right here, the ribbon. The ribbon is the uh, is the hero for me always. When I see something that has a ribbon microphones, I'm like, there, there it is. <laughs> that's that's it. And then we've got the large diaphragms capturing the room. 
And you think with quadruple felt, four, four layers of felt, yeah, four, you think that that would take all of the dynamic and all of the whatever out, but it creates us, it creates something very beautiful. You still got a little bit of that attack. Yeah. And Alessandro, um, can you tell us, you know, because uh, Andromeda, so uh, seems like the four layers of felt were very thin. So maybe could you give us a little insight on that, um, about, about the type of felt that you used? Um, I just love that. I'm just going to turn off the, um, <clears throat> the, the, the room microphones and just turn those ribbon mics up some. Let's see what we have as far as effects. So we've got a little um, hall. And then this diffusion, the diffusion delay is what I'm telling, what I'm talking about being in contact seven. It's, it's just like... Um, This is just the ribbons. That's so cool. Now let's see. And we've got like some cassette things that we can bring some lo-fi processing into it, kind of crunch it a little bit. Let me see, let's get into another key. Really cool. Yeah, something natural. And then we can even turn this into mono. Yeah, the, the, the hammer's like... to another one of the snapshots. Um, let's go to um, Cinema Felt. Now this has all of the uh, mics on, the stereo, the small, the large condensers for the room, the small condensers, and then the ribbons. Okay, and, I, and I've just got to dial this dynamic range because I want to get, I want to hear, um, just hear. And you hear just a little bit of the life in there with, Let's go, let's, let me get into, um, let me get into E. So, okay, yeah, that's, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Okay, so that'll activate that cassette section, so here we go.
like that diffusion uh, the delay. Um, just it's almost like um, one of those infinite uh, type of um, yeah. Yeah, it's just like. like the modern delay and see what we can do. The simple delay controls um, is just brings it so so much to life. Yeah, Nigel, it has a <clears throat> it has an a, almost like a bell like quality to it. Um, listen, and that delay is just sinking and going. I love that. And we can just uh, control the sin, the delay sin. Right there. Yeah, that's a little too much. <laughs> let's go back to that, uh, let's go to a tape, like a tape and uh, turn the, um, turn the uh, time to like one half. And let's just use um, the ribbons. I love having the controls just kind of like right there. And let's just uh, send more, a little more in. Let's do a quarter notes. There we go. This has got so much character to it. Yeah, the tape delay has, has a nice little character to it. Wow, 
Let's just check out um, a couple more of these snapshots. The nostalgia, the nostalgia felt, and this just is using the room mics with a um, little diffusion and hall. Okay, let's see. And there I am reaching for that dynamic range. Harp like almost like playing a harp up here. Last but not least, on the snapshots, the um, repetita, repetita felt, uh, yeah. Okay, now this has got some. I love sounds that move. feedback and uh, just adjust that a little bit. It's almost like the delay is kind of skipping like tick ba dunk ka -tick -ka -tick. Let's see. Yeah. Another um, another trick, I guess not a trick, but another great feature of this um, of verticale is that uh, oh yeah, we were just uh, we were just listening to that on uh, Amazon Music uh, the other day, and I guess that just uh, <clears throat> that pulsing just kind of put me in that in that frame of mind. Yeah, imagine me and you. It just, it just triggers, it just triggers it. So, <laughs> okay. So what they've given us, not just the felted version, uh, they've given us also a non-felted version of the same piano. So we have a natural or a pure version 
as, as well as the felted. So I'm going to load. Um, I'm going to load that up, and we've got you've got two snapshots in. Um, you've got two snapshots in verticality. You've got the uh, felt and then the natural. So I'm just going to drag, uh, drag that over, and so now we have the natural felt. I mean, no, the natural piano. So um, same mic setup, but this is not uh, not felted. So I can't wait to hear hear this. Now this is. Um, just the natural, the balanced natural. So here we go. small condensers my mama done told me when I was in wee pants my mama done told me son this. Here, there we go. It's just got attitude here. The now, let me take the reverb off so we can just hear. we go yeah the release samples so um yeah for me for me i'd like i would just like to have just a little more decay <laughs> but um that's really fun though but it's just again it's just got that stuff character. I don't know why I, I, I just got in that boogie. Yeah, and there you got that top end that just got that beautiful ringing. Very cool. <laughs> it's, uh, it's really cool. Okay, so let's go to uh, Crush Master and uh, just hear what that sounds like. Get the diffusion going on, I hear it. I like that delay. Okay, 
and there you go. You can go. That's really cool. Okay. And then nostalgia natural. It just oozes with character. <laughs> Got that tape deck sound there, just to give it a little little personality. That's a lot of fun. That's a lot of fun. Okay, so what I want to do, um, let's just do this. Um, let's do this. So let's load up. Um, okay, I do have it. I do have it here. I've got the natural here. Let's um, let's drop down the. Um, yeah, the tape deck is fun. Okay, so I'm going to put the felt back on the top. And and put the um, put the natural on the bottom, and let's go back to like the cinematic felt, and then down here, let's go with the um, the natural. The the let's go to okay. Well, let's just do cinema on both of those. So now we have. Um, we have the dynamic range and that, all that. So let's um, take a listen to what that sounds like. Turn the natural down just a little bit.
the diffusion. Thank you, Alessandro. I appreciate that. And honestly, <laughs> honestly, when when we when we think about that, it, it's that the instruments almost play me. Uh, that's what I say a lot of times because when I'm when I'm when I'm hearing, it takes me somewhere. Uh, it just transports, you know, it just transports you to so many different places. The sounds take you and the, the sounds pretty much play me. I think that is what's so fun about, um, um, about this.